Hey guys, welcome back. Fancy here. Uh, we are on floor 100 of TOA. Uh, this is the general strategy to taking down the boss. This isn't the easiest strategy. There is another easier way to take down this boss not doing like this. This is the easiest way to take him down if you have the units to do it. So right now I'm running Breda, um, Bernard, Belladon, Kona, and Theomars. You can replace Theomars with any nuker. Uh, Breda mainly here for the attack bar reduction, Bernard for that speed advantage against the boss, Belladon for armor break, and uh, Kona to remove the healing reduction from this tower. Uh, healing tower, very, very annoying. There is also a strategy of uh, killing this boss without using a single DPS monster. Th it is how I done TOA the first time. Uh, I'm going to include a link somewhere like there or below um, in the description of the other video how I cleared TOA 100 without using a single DPS. Um, but uh, be warned that strategy takes maybe an hour to do this boss fight. So. If you don't want to do that, if you want to avoid that, then you know have a DPSer to take down this boss. This boss is neutral element, so any DPSer will work against him as long as he can survive, um, you know, his AOE and stuff. So I'm gonna armor break this tower. Uh, we're always start the fight out um, killing this tower. I'm gonna reset the attack bar of the boss, you know, just so he doesn't get a turn. And I'm going to actually just buff the Mars, and we are just going to start working on this tower. Actually, there's no way, there's actually no real way to take down that tower. Um, take down this tower without, without dots. Actually, there is. If you have some, some sort of, um, just you know, like attack based on. Enemies eight max HP. I don't know why I can't. I'm I'm not thinking properly today. I'm just I don't know how to describe things. <laughs> All right. Um. I use that to heal Theomars back a bit. I think it should be fine. I kind of regret bringing Belladon for this fight. I think I should have brought the one I should have brought was Veramos because I can use Veramos to um to get the turn advantage against against them. So kind of my bad, but we're still fine. I'm going to reduce the boss's attack bar again, and we're just going to keep hitting this, speed buff to get more turns, keep darting down this tower, I'm going to heal up again, and we're going to put more dots on that tower. Now I think the boss is going to use his AoE next turn uh, if he gets his next turn yeah he's no he didn't he do, didn't use his AOE again okay I'm gonna speed buff Bernard for that turn advantage again kinda annoying how he slowed down my Bernard uh, I think I can use Beldon's attack bar fill just to get me more turns and I'm gonna reset the boss again and we're gonna armor break this tower Keep hitting it. Keep hitting it. Come on. I think I should give. I think I should give Bernard. Actually, wait. I shouldn't have done that. Okay, I kind of regret it. Oh, I forgot to armor. I forgot to debuff the boss. I forgot to debuff the boss. Uh, there, most people debuff the boss, but if you can survive without debuffing him, just don't debuff him until you're you're about to start killing him. So this tower actually is going to die next turn. I'm going to treat it as dead, and we're just going to start hitting the boss now. Going to heal back up. Uh, I'm going to give Theomars that turn to nuke the boss really hard with armor break. Wait, that was like that was like a giant chunk of his HP. Going to attack bar reduction on him so he can't get a turn. And we're going to yeah, I'm going to research Theomars again, you know, for that real heavy nuke. I'm 
more attack speed. Gonna heal up. Um, she thought tower. This tower could be a little bit annoying, but uh, whatever. You know, we'll, we'll just we'll just whatever it. We're gonna attack debuff him. Actually, wait. I don't need to attack debuff him. He's gonna get a turn. All right, I'm gonna research self so I can remove that thing off the Mars next turn. Next time my Konamiya gets a turn. Um, I'll save my attack bar reduction. Heal the Mars back up. So we're kind of in a little bit of downtime right now, waiting for someone to armor break the boss. All right, that worked. Reset his attack bar, and everyone just starts nuking him again. I should probably finish off this tower anyways. You know, since it's, since it's about to die, I'm gonna just kill it. Because no one else is gonna be attacking the boss. Well, everyone's gonna be attacking the boss if I'm doing it like this. If you want to go straight for the boss, you gotta make sure you have enough DPS to actually take him down before the almighty stacking gets crazy. Okay, it's a it's about to get crazy. It's it's getting crazy. Armor break, start nuking hard. Try to put the attack debuff on the boss if you're if you're trying to kill him this way. Uh, it doesn't matter if Almighty stacks one more stack. It's better if your DPS doesn't actually die in one turn. I think I can get another turn before the boss moves again. I'm going to use this for that attack bar advantage. Alright, alright. Reset his attack bar another turn. Okay, he decided to nuke my Berta, which is whatever. And he is about to die. He is very, very close to dying. I think in another few turns I should be able to finish him off. Oh, that attack bar reset that missed. Alright, come on, just a little bit more. And I'll have him by the balls. No, I already have him by the balls. He's he's about to get owned. <laughs> and that's how you deal with TOA 100. Um, if you have DPSers and attack power reduction, that's how you do it. Make sure you have one person to remove debuffs. A healer, a uh, speed buff is always nice to get that turn advantage. I couldn't fit a slow debuffer in here because um, I kind of need it belt on as well to you know keep the keep the um, keep my keep my team healthy that's what I meant uh, I probably should have used I, I think I could have used Veramos instead of Theomars it could have gotten gotten me a faster clear because Veramos also does a lot of damage and he can remove debuffs every single turn so I can just use my uh, Veramos to keep my team alive and Theomars and Veramos can nuke down the boss much faster than just just Theomars Yep, that is how you do TO100, uh, and that concludes our TOA guide for this month. Um, thank you guys for watching. Thank, thanks to those. Thank, thank, thank you those that have that have um, stuck around and watched watched like you know. Hopefully, I helped. I helped you clear it. Um, you know, if you haven't cleared TOA yet, and if you still haven't cleared TOA yet, don't give up. Um, you might not have the units, but if you or if you just completed your Giants B10, if you didn't complete your Giants B10 team, then 
um, this might not be for you. But if you have already completed your Giants B10 team and you farm Giants for a while, you have some decent runes on your units, uh, don't be afraid to throw those units into TOA and try it out. You still have a few days left. And yeah, just, you know, if you're lucky, you'll be able to clear it. If you're not, um, there's always next time, right? All right. Thank you. Thank you guys so much. Um, happy summoning. Peace out. <laughs>